Well, it's Wednesday, and uh, here I am sitting in a uh, dark room in front of a computer screen with a Green Bay Packers throwback jersey on. It's time for episode two of the Hippie Trip. As I mentioned the last time, in fact, if you don't know what the Hippie Trip is, go back and watch episode one on Facebook, and it'll kind of fill you in. We're kind of putting the icing um, on a uh, record uh, we started, a uh, recording project we started several months ago, uh, redoing a bunch of old psychedelic songs from the late 60s. If you looked at uh, the video I, uh, I put, posted the link to on YouTube today, you got to see a song that was, um, the, I think the number, it was charted at number five, it was top chart position on the Billboard charts in the fall of 1966. Uh, it's by a group out of San Jose, California called Count Five, and it was their biggest hit called Psychotic Reaction. Uh, you know, typical forlorn love stuff, boy meets girl, boy falls in love with girl, Girl hates boy, boy goes nuts. Uh, but an interesting song, and uh, it's it, interesting because it uh, has some harmony, uh, different harmony parts in it, and it has a very simple harmonica part and a double time part in the middle. So uh, when we decided to do it, I decided to keep the harmonica part simple in the beginning, but then we thought we'd bring in for harmonica the secret weapon. This is called a sure green bullet. Um, and it's a really popular mic for uh, recording harmonica on. It was actually invented back in the 1950s, and I used to have a big stand on it. Um, and guys like Broderick Crawford for Highway Patrol would uh, be, in fact, you can get an idea what it sounds like. Hello, one, two, check one, two. Um, basically, I'm actually running this to a guitar amplifier uh, modeled after a Fender Champ. So it's a little uh, guitar amplifier with a lot of distortion on it. So you get the, the bluesy Chicago sound out of it. So uh, basically what I'm going to do, I've been working on it, uh, working on, I've got the, the easy stuff done, now I'm getting down to the hard stuff. So I'm going to play what I have with the track so far, and again, this is just what we call a tracking mix. So it's not the final mix that may change as the song comes together, but I'll play a little bit of it, and uh, you'll hear, you can hear the first distorted harp part that I, I did. I should maybe give you an idea more what this sounds like with the harmonic on it. Let me, in fact, get rid of the um, other mic that I'm on and just go to this one. There we go, checking one, two. And, tell, and when you put the harmonica on it, you get the idea. So here's the track as we have it so far. The beginning. <laughs> You get the idea. I better get the mic up here. So basically, what I'm doing now is I'm. You heard the first distorted harp part, and now what I've been kind of doing here the last, uh, you know, 15 minutes or so before I started the tape, is doing the other fills that go in between those lines of the verse. So I'm going to do that now. And actually, I use something called Polar. It stands for Performance Oriented Loop Recording. So I take a chunk of the song, four bars, and I play it over and over again and do several passes on it because, frankly, I'm not that great on harmonica. And every once in a while, I'll hit a good one, and then that's the one I save. And I work my way through the whole song like that, and we get to the end of it, then we have a finished harmonica part. So we're going to set up now for a polar session. I'm going to go back to the next part, and it'll repeat over and over again, and I'm just going to start uh, adding parts. Every time it goes around, I'll add it. I'll, Play it again, and I'll pick out the best one and then print that to the track. So here we go. Oh, technical glitch. <laughs> here we go. Now here we go. Now, okay, we're going to get the loop here. So the last 
last two are okay. I don't want to start out uh, too crazy. So I print that to the track, then I move on to the next part. So basically you can see how the song gets built, bit by bit. We'll be back and revisit this song later when we do the guitar overdubs on it. But uh, that's it for uh, tonight. Uh, Psychotic Reaction, The Count Five. It's the Hippie Trip Episode 2. Until tomorrow, peace.